The sun is set behind the Coliseum. The stadium lights are on, and we have a game tonight. This is Duncan Fisher giving you the play-by-play. -play. There are a couple of Steiner up-and-comers in tonight's game, and it has drawn quite a crowd. In the last Coliseum game, there was some real tension in the stands. The Davion and Steiner supporters seemed like they were coming close to blows. But the security is tight, and all signs point to a fabulous game. The big crowd tonight is a good thing, too, because the medium season has been off to a slow start so far. The opening games have been pretty predictable. And last week, there was a scandal when Bobby Killer Fields was accused of throwing a game. But the fans haven't lost their faith, and tonight's game looks like it's going to be a good one. The game is on. One of the combatants tonight is both a Merc and Solaris Junk. His name is Alex Haight. This no-nonsense fighting machine had a sensational rookie year and followed it up by disappearing for mysterious business for two whole seasons. Everyone thought that was the last of him, but he came back and is still doing some serious damage in his fifth season. It's a no-brainer that he'll make it into the big game. It's kind of unusual, but he still fights a couple of medium matches every year. He says he's scoping the field. Alex isn't a man of many words, but he's a clever warrior. I wonder what he sees out there tonight. Looks like a pretty good match out there today. A lot of folks prefer medium to light matches because there is more action. You have more power to bear on your enemy and better odds of hitting them. You still get some speed, but some of those medium mechs can be configured to be heavy hitters. Some fans like their games fast and furious. I like them more like this. People are fighting smart and trying to minimize their exposure. A good pilot knows just how to turn to spread out the damage. It makes for a longer fight, which is more about skill. So the talk is all about last week's medium match. Bobby Fields had been cleaning house in the medium circuit. He made the final two in the last factory match. Then a badly mauled Merrick rookie simply tore him apart. Fields barely even fired back. All the media is saying that the killer took a dive. I'm not so sure. He claims that he had some equipment failure. From my time in the circuits, I believe him. 
No matter how much you pay to keep your mech fully operational, accidents will happen. Especially when you're facing another pilot who wants nothing more than to be that accident. But Fields has been barred from competition until a full inquiry is held. I just hope this whole thing blows over and we can get back to the game. Sometimes a kill sneaks up on you, like that one. Pinpoint firing can lead to a fast kill. Kapow! Ha <laughs> ha! Well, Alex is slumming it, and he gets nailed. He was scoping out the competition, and looks like he found some. I don't know whether he was just overconfident, or if he just got outplayed, but regardless, I bet he ain't a happy camper. See you next game, Alex. Perspector. Spectre makes it look easy. Now let's see if he can go the distance. wins. The Coliseum has seen some intense fighting tonight. Although those medium mechs are fast, they can pack some serious punch. It was quite a slugfest, and rookie Merc Spectre takes the victory today. He smashed through some serious opposition, and he's earned the accolades tonight. Live from the sands, it's Duncan Fisher wishing all of you a good night. <laughs>